Good morning guys! Today is a super super exciting morning. I have tried to book these flights twice already with the two debit cards that I have and they've both been rejected which is great. I don't have a clue why. I've got enough money in my bank to pay for the flights and for some reason they've been rejected so I'm about to try and book them on Zoe's card. She's very lovely, very lovelily lovelily so that I can borrow some money and then I'll pay her back straight away. Um, basically, as you know at the end of yesterday's video, as I told you, I've been chatting to Roman Atwood recently and we've been trying to arrange a way for us to hang out together. The only issue is that he lives literally like 14 hour flight away or something. He lives like in Ohio, I think it is. Well, I hope it is because that's where I'm about to book my flights to. So. I'm about to book flights now to hang out with him. I'm going to fly to Chicago, then change to Ohio. Never flown by myself before. I've never also changed on a plane. Like, I've only ever flown direct. So, two new things are going to be happening. And do you know when they're going to be happening? Tomorrow. <laughs> I'm literally booking this flight for tomorrow, straight after my theory test. So as you know, I've got my driving theory test. Basically, tomorrow is gonna to be super, super busy and eventful. I've got my driving theory test tomorrow at 8 a.m. And then I'm booking a flight, more or less straight after. I just have to nip back, grab my suitcase, then go off to the airport and fly by myself for like 14 hours or something. I arrive there and it's like midnight. Wow. Okay, should we do it? This little button here is everything. Are you ready? Oh, I'm scared. Oh, authorizing. Dun, dun, dun. No blooming way. Look at that, guys. I have no idea when the last time I vlogged was. I think it may have even been this morning. Anyways, it is now like 5.30 p.m in the evening. I've had the busiest day of revising for my theory test, spending time with Zoe because obviously I'm going away tomorrow now, um, getting ready to pack. I lost my passport for like half the day so I was finding that and now I've just realised that half the stuff that I want to take to America, like cameras and stuff, is all in my office. So I've got to grab it all now. Look at the outfit that I'm sporting today everybody. I have got my coat on with what looks like no t-shirt but I have in fact got a vest on. Then I've got some pyjama bottom shorts, shoes that I just slipped on with no socks because I'm literally in that much of a rush today. Oh my gosh. Oh, that'd be good. Right, I've got to make a pile of things that I want to take. Headphones. That is a definite must have for when you're traveling. As many batteries as possible for my vlogging camera. That again. Oh, I might also take a spare vlogging camera. Spare vlogging camera, just in case I break my one my vlogging camera charger with another spare battery in it, so that's three batteries. I've also got another battery at home and obviously the one I'm using this, so that's like four batteries or something. This will always come in handy. iPhone wire. I definitely need this. This here is an SD card reader so that I can edit my daily vlogs. Without that, I literally wouldn't be able to edit. Do I need a GoPro? I don't. If I need a GoPro, I'm sure Roman's got a couple that I can borrow. Couple of pens, always handy. I don't know whether to bring like a proper big camera, like one of these ones or not, but I feel like that's just stupid. If I need a big camera, Roman again is gonna have a big camera. But that's the positive thing. We're going to stay in there with another YouTuber. Means that anything I may need, he's already got, so I have to take less stuff with me. Oh, I nearly pressed that one. Do not want to press that one. Ground. Close. Missy head. Nala. Should we go to bed, baby? Hey. Come on. I know you can hear me in there. Hello. Nala. <laughs> she literally pretends to be asleep. Nala, I know you're awake. Come on. Nala. Nala. Let's go to bed. She's literally pretending, look. Nala. Hey. How funny is that? Nala. You're not tricking me. Hey. There we go. Should we go to bed? 
Oh, you sleepy pup. Should we put you to bed? It's like 20 minutes past 11 at night now. And I thought to end the vlog, end the very short vlog that has been today because I've literally just been practicing my theory test all day more or less for tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. I have my driving theory test. And I've also just been getting everything ready and packing and stuff. So I thought I'd show you what I've got. So this is what I'm going to wear tomorrow. Just some shoes and socks and tracksuit bottoms and a hoodie and a plain t-shirt. Just all really, really cosy clothes. Just keeping that out just to charge my laptop tonight so it's got full charge. My wallet and a hat for tomorrow. And then in my suitcase, I'm just going to, I'm only going to take hand luggage. Which I haven't decided if it's a good or a bad decision, but I think... Because I'm changing in Chicago, I've got to do one stopover, um, and I've never stopped over before. I just don't want any chance at all of me losing my luggage. Like, the last thing I want, because I'm only there for a few days, is to get there, my luggage not be there, then be like, okay, we're going to send it in four days. They send it once more during the way home, and, like, yeah. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm only going to take hand luggage, just to simplify everything, so nothing leaves my side. I'll show you what I've got in here. I have got dun 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 just this for a little bit of fun, just to do maybe with his kids. And then some boots, just nice simple, doesn't really matter if I mess them up or not, if they get a bit dirty or whatever. A jumper, six t-shirts in there. Oh, and a vest to wear just for like cozy clothes. And then in this side, I've got my coat, and then I've also got Five pairs of boxers, two pairs of jeans, five pairs of socks, and a pair of tracksuit bottom shorts, just like this kind of thing, what I'm wearing today. So that's all my clothes and everything, all those outfit choices. And then in my bag, taking a rucksack, I've got my passport holder, a notepad, headphones, a little box of all wires and stuff, my wash bag. And that's basically it. I think that's all I need. And then I've also got like camera charger and camera battery and vlogging camera and stuff, but that's all in the other, oh, and I've got a spare vlogging camera, but that's all in the other room because I need to charge everything up tonight. So basically the plan, the call of action is that tomorrow morning I have to leave here at half past seven, at half past seven, I have to be at the place where I'm doing my theory test for quarter to eight. I start my theory test at eight o'clock in the morning I think, I think it on average it takes like an hour, I think. But every time I've been doing practice tests today, I've been doing them in like 10 or 12 minutes, not even that. So it'll probably take me like, I don't know, half an hour or something tomorrow. Uh, I really hope I pass. Like, my fingers are so crossed because I just don't want to fail it. Like, I don't, I don't mind. I wouldn't mind failing it. It's not that it's like embarrassing to fail, although it is a little bit embarrassing. Um, it's more just because... It gets so busy at Christmas time that if I fail this, I'm going probably going to have to wait until like middle of December to be able to retake it because it's so busy at the moment. So that's that's going to be the annoying thing is that if I fail, I won't be able to pass my driving test because I can't book my driving test till I pass this, probably until like after Christmas. So fingers crossed, I pass this. I've done ten practice theory tests today. And I failed one this morning, and then all the other ones I passed today. And just now I got like 48 and 47 and 48 and stuff like that out of 50, which is like pretty damn good. You only need 43 to pass. So that side of it is looking good. It is just, why am I not in focus? There we go. It is just the, um, what's the other one called? Hazard perception that I'm a little bit like ee, about because I find it quite hard to practice that one because there isn't really much of it online where you can practice. I've only had one practice go on hazard perception. So I feel if I, if I fail my theory test tomorrow, it's gonna to be because I failed hazard, it's gonna be because I failed my hazard perception. And that is so annoying, so annoying, because it's so simple, but so simple that it's also so simple to mess up. Anyways, I'm literally on a plane as you're watching this, like flying in the air. That is awesome. That's so cool. It's gonna be a busy old day tomorrow. I think in total it's like 13 hours of traveling in one day and I land in Ohio at like five past midnight, like five past midnight. So technically Tuesday morning. Um, and I think Roman's gonna meet me there. I'm a little bit nervous <laughs> because Roman is known for his pranks. 
and I just feel like I'm gonna get there. We're gonna be driving back to his house and like a fake police car will pull us over and like, arrest us or the car will like set on fire on it. I just don't trust him. I know what he's like with his pranks. Or oh, I'm gonna be like sleeping one night in bed in my boxers and then the room will catch on fire or like he'll pretend to like be a burglar and run in and kidnap me or I don't even know what he's gonna get up to. I'm genuinely nervous about that bit. But other than that, I'm just so excited to meet the family and everything and hang out with them for a couple of days and just get away, you know? And I said to him, is the weather good? I'm really excited because the UK weather is rubbish. He said, no, it's been raining and it is freezing. And I was like, okay, it's basically the same as the UK then. But anyways, I'm super, super excited. If you're excited for me to hang out with Roman and stuff, um, let me know in the comments if you watch Roman's videos already. If you if you want to wish me some good luck, actually, you, you might already know, you might not if I've passed my theory test. If you want to wish me good luck for my theory, give the video a thumbs up. Although it's kind of already happened by the time you're watching this. So I would have either passed or failed. And then I've got to tell you in tomorrow's video whether I passed or failed. Oh, guys, please say I pass. I just have a feeling that I'm just going to mess something up really simple and fail. I don't know. Anyways, I'm going to end the vlog in here now, guys, because Zoe is fast asleep next door. And what I say next door, not the next door neighbour's house, in our bedroom. I'm in, I'm in the room next door to our bedroom. Anyways, I'll catch you tomorrow. I'm super excited. Next time I see you, I'm going to be, like, travelling on a plane and everything that day. So I'll catch you tomorrow. Good night. Marky Bat Bat has just got here. He's got a package of secret stuff. Secret stuff, then. I'm scared. Yeah,